In today's video, we're going to show how you can filter and sort through the list of available automated trading systems on the NinjaTrader Eye systems to find systems that be, might be right for you. First place you can start, up here at the top, there are top 10 lists. They show top 10 lists not only for the current session, also the previous session, the last month, the last year, and since inception. The default setting is to show by net results, which is PL. You can also switch to percentages by selecting suggested capital or required capital. If we go back to the main list here, you'll see there are currently over 1,500 automated trading systems available on the platform. It would take quite a bit of time to go through them all one by one. What we can do is instead apply some filters to try to find the system or systems that are a better fit. Click on the drop down. You'll see there are some quick filters pre-programmed in. You can apply them just by clicking. Or you can go down to the advanced filter section to put in custom filters. Let's say, for example, you are interested in an automated trading system on uh, US index futures. We could go down and apply a filter for the market traded. You could choose the S&P mid cap, the S&P 500, NASDAQ, Mini Russell, and also the Dow. Add that filter and you'll see it shortened the list down to 566 systems that only trade those markets. If we want to filter further, let's say for example, you were only interested in systems with suggested capital up to $25,000. We can put $25,000 in here as the cap. And now you see we're down to 104. Let's say further, we're interested in systems that have been tracked for at least six months in the live market environment. So we can go down to track since, update this to six months back from today's date, add the filter, and now you see we're down to 66 systems. From here, all these column heads are sortable if you want to focus on those with the highest returns, you can click to sort from high to low. Or if you're more interested in focusing on risk, you can sort by drawdowns from low to high. This is a good place to get started. And from here, this will help you save a lot of time in selecting the system or systems that might be a good fit for you and your account.